Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Thank you so much for clicking on the video. Came to see Spider-Man No Way Home. So this is going to be a spoiler-free review, of course, because the movie just came out, which is going to be very, very hard to do this review. So we'll be very vague. I mean, I think we're always pretty vague with our reviews either way it goes. Even though there's a lot of spoilers all over social. Well, see, look, I actually did good, and I stood away from most of them. I did find out about one spoiler, which I accidentally found. So I, you saw way more spoilers than I did, but I did I kept a, trying to insta, but it's like every other TikTok that I saw that's was why about you, it. That's why you wouldn't get on it. I don't really consider it spoiler talk, but just in case, I'll go ahead and pre-warn you. Anything that was in the trailer or in the poster, I don't consider spoiler because that's like public knowledge. And I totally understand if you haven't seen a poster or haven't seen a trailer. I'm just putting that that's on you but it's out there for you to see so it's and not it's like people hidden. like me i don't look at trailers i mean i understand but like i wouldn't put that as spoiler but as far as everything else that's happening um we'll just be very vague we'll kind of secretly talk about it maybe in a way Probably not because you'll you'll decipher our coding there's not too much coding to decipher with it we're not that yeah, we're not difficult to decipher. Yeah, at all. <laughs> uh, so this one does pick up right from where uh, Far From Home ended. Uh, Mysterio. Mysterio, right? Mysterio? Mysterio. <laughs> They have some weird names, you guys. Even like some. I need to see that again. We just finished watching that one right before we came to see this one. Uh, but of course, um, he did out Peter Parker for being Peter Parker and Spider Man. If you haven't seen that one in a minute, uh, check that one out. Just kind of refresh your mind a little bit. It is advisable to see all of them because they all intertwine. Because here, um, we are within the multiverse, and of course, we did get a glimpse of that from Far From Home because supposedly Mysterio was from the multiverse. And of course, if you see Spidey, uh, Spider Verse into, or Spidey, Spider Man into the Spider Verse, that's where I believe I was introduced into um, the Spider Verse multiverse uh, territory. And then, of course, if you've seen What If, they also kind of talk about that, or yeah, right? It's like mentioned the, mm -hmm. the multiverse and stuff like that. But before we do officially go into like each other's like very vague reactions response to the movies as always whenever i do a comic book review just kind of my disclaimer for all of the new viewers and it really does incorporate for all of us we do not read the comic books our knowledge goes from whatever we get from the movies we don't know that original content so this love this is just coming from the average janes coming your way of what just a non like official comic book person goes because i know everybody's gonna be like we're in the comic books <laughs> no i don't care about what the comic books no nothing about nothing the comics. about that this is just from an average person there wait it's, it's because i need my thoughts <laughs> my thoughts because of no spoilers and yeah it's hard stuff that i could say but the it's what i expected mm -hmm. like it's what i wanted stuff happened <sighs> damn it <laughs> <laughs> can't say that because that gives it away <laughs> i did like it but like but you want to say more i want to say more i've i really liked it the costumes i thought for spider-man i thought he, it was gonna be more different <laughs> no not that no i can't say without <laughs> spoiling stuff <laughs> you y'all saw the villains they were awesome it's it's awesome to see them coming back for this movie and i want to know i want to know too me too i want to know what happens <laughs> to them <laughs> that scene of him with his spidey senses mm -hmm. yes. it was like really intense yes. of him sensing something wrong yeah and evil and i'm like what when that happened i'm like what happened I thought it was the other yeah, side. Yeah, I thought yeah. it was the lizard guy. <laughs> but it was awesome. I really liked the shots. They were they were super cool. And just I really liked the concept of the of, of the movie of the multiverse. Mm -hmm. And I can't wait until they make another one. <laughs> that's that that's gonna be it for me because before can't say, I can't say shit. Yeah. <laughs> it makes me wonder though, is there really a multiverse of us? I know. What am I liking that one? <laughs> my evil my hideous as far as like the worst person am I in jail? i'd rather be in this one where i'm not oh in jail oh my though. god imagine if i'm like married with a shitload of kids 
Oh, the horror. I enjoyed it. I liked it very much. Like we've mentioned, I've seen a lot of the spoilers, so I wasn't shocked on a lot of stuff. But at the same time, I was because I'd see a little, little wee piece, but not the whole thing. You didn't know the build up to get yes. there. So uh, when we got to that part, it's like, oh, okay, I get it now. It's like, oh, all right, all right. Really, is that gonna happen? I mean, it's Spider-Man, the whole jumping around and flying around, that's cool. Villains are non or non-villains yeah. in, the, in, in the case of some of them. Yeah. But it, which you already know if you've seen the other Spider-Man. Messy and in theaters. Mm-hmm. Well, it is only in theaters so far, but definitely don't wait for it to be streaming no, and I'll be surprised. Be surprised who doesn't actually get to see it in theaters, considering how packed it's been the last few days. And I'm guessing it's because of Spider-Man. All right, guys, I loved the movie. I've been super, super hyped for it. Spider-Man is my favorite, like Marvel uh, superhero. He's like awesome. I love him. He I mean, sometimes he gets on my nerves a little bit too goody too. She kind of like Captain America. Uh, just kind of annoying sometimes, but I just like him because he's just your friendly neighborhood spider who's been to space But he's still cool again like when it comes to the villains We do get all the villains that we've seen within um, all three spider-man movies You know Sam Raimi is the ones with Tobey Maguire, which is my spider-man Andrew Garfield's and one thing that I really loved about um, Ele Electro I think that was his name which is named Jamie Foxx again This is not technically considered spoiler because we do see them in the trailer and in the poster I like how they make fun of how he looks lame in the, in the Amazing Spider-Man 2 like his costume there because he looks he definitely got an upgrade so he's looking like 10 times better here. Desiree was having a hard time saying things like I'm having a hard time because I was literally thinking oh I'm gonna say this in my review and then I was like no you can't say that uh, but I will pre-warn y'all that I will be saying things just FYI on my monthly wrap up. I will talk talk spoiler territory there. I'm giving y'all plenty of time to see the damn movie so I can freely talk about the movie spoilers at that particular time. But if y'all really want to see like where this one like falls um, like I said yesterday in my review I think I did leave it on there. Um, I will be ranking all 11 Spider-Man movies. The way that they incorporated basically like all three Spider-Man uh, villains within this particular movie was really really clever and it wasn't like forced or cringy or anything like that the way that just those movies were incorporated i had heard that i was gonna get emotional so i was prepared with my tissues i didn't cry as much as i expected to cry Kind of the same thing with like in game. With in game, you guys, I took my box of tissues because everybody kept telling me this one kept like, and I didn't cry. So I'm thinking, Did like, I cry with it. Yeah, you told me that I you cried. Be, I cried with it. I didn't cry. I was just like, I cried really. on this one too, but not like. Uh, honestly, now when I watch in game, I'm like, oh my god, there goes the tears. You're like, how many <laughs> years late? So maybe uh, with the more that I watch this one, uh, the more of the tears that will be coming. There are some emotional factors to it. Um, so maybe have like just one little handkerchief, one little tissue ready to kind of like you know, dab those eyes. Um, I actually came without any like eyeliner, mascara, nothing. So I was like, I don't want it ruined. Um, I was like, I brought it with me so I could put it on so I can look semi -de decent for you guys here. Um, I don't know what to say without saying stuff. All you have to know is that I loved it, you guys. <laughs> you say anything you else can't without say anything without spoiling at all. You really, really can't. Um, there are two post-credit scenes. Well, technically, there's one post-credit scene, and then basically like, like a, a trailer. trailer for Doctor Strange Two. I will give you that. Um, I don't think that's a spoiler. Would that be a spoiler? No. I'm not... No. If, no. If, if you want to stay and watch the yeah. trailer, yeah, you don't have to stay for the second one after the you get the first one. That's good. Uh, cause it really well, everybody is. Everybody already knew there was a Doctor yeah. Strange Two coming. And so before we do give you our score, um, which I'm sure you really know what it is. If you haven't already, don't forget to give this video a like. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't yet. And of course, don't forget to hit the notification bell so you'll be notified each time that I post something new. Go ahead and wait on letting me know what your favorite Spider-Man movie is until my ranking video. I still need to re-watch the Amazing Spider-Man movies. So um, that video will be in a couple days or next week. I don't know, you guys. It's coming. It's coming. All right, you guys. So, um, 
Are we in agreement? Yes. Okay. Uno, dos, tres. Large popcorn. If um you see Spider Man No Way Home, let me know down below. What did you think about it? Did you like it? Did you love it? Did you hate it? Was it just not for you? Are you planning on checking it out or skipping on it? If you are a Spider Man fan or just part of like if you love the Marvel universe, definitely, definitely, definitely check this out. It is a must watch in theaters. We saw it in Dolby. We're about that Dolby Live IMAX theater. Like the seats are not comfortable, so I'm not about that life anymore. They'll be like, I can sit back and everything, so it's good. Um, and then and Lagre, no this way, this yeah, that Shrey seat wasn't my working. My seat was broken. I could literally take the panel off <laughs> off of the seat. Like oh. the legs, like lifted up a little bit. We probably should have told them so they could have. They I don't know if they knew. They probably do, but they don't care. All right, guys, that is it from us today. Until next time. Um, see you guys at the sessions. Bye.